Hi, fishy folks! Another fish unboxing from Michael and Michael's Fish Room. Guys, don't forget to check out michaelsfishroom.com uh, where you can buy most of the guppies you see in my fish room. If you see a guppy in my fish room that's not on the website, shoot me an email at uh, michaelsfishroom at gmail.com and maybe we can work something out. Sometimes I don't have enough stock of a certain fish to put it on the website, but I might have an extra pair or a trio for you. So another unboxing. Got this from eBay. Now, I do want to show you something. Big thing that says fragile, and right next to where it says fragile, the box is all crushed. So, we'll see what happens. Uh, I ordered these Wednesday. Wednesday, Tuesday, or Wednesday. Boom, they're here on Friday. So let's use my handy dandy knife and see what I got. Think it's more plecos? Perhaps. Maybe it's something new. Maybe I'm finally getting discus. In this little tiny box, I doubt it. Maybe it's an arowana folded in half. No. Be careful with the knife, folks. We don't want to cut our finger off. So far, so good. Um, I did find something interesting about this box, which I don't do. Um, I do put live fish on my box. I do put stickers that I got from uh, Jason at Jadrin's Aquatics. But there's a note that says liquid Section 3.4A, packaging compliant. I think that's pretty neat. Uh, I bought these from uh, a user, like I said, on eBay. John Lee is his name. And he had like a thousand uh, reviews, all 100% positive. I'm pretty excited. So we got some really nice packaging. Packaging is important, as I know. I might have to get the knife back out. Nope. That's pretty nice. Double bagged. Yeah. Huh. Nice big bag. Nice big packaging. Nothing leaked. So you want to know what they are, don't you? Here, I'll show you. You can look. Can you tell? Probably not. You're just going to have to wait and see. So fishy folks, here's what we're gonna do with this bag. I'm gonna acclimatize them. I'm gonna throw them in the uh, in the tank, just like this in the bag. Let the temperature kind of uh, equalize. Oh, this has been in my house for about five and a half, six hours. So I'll let it sit in there for a couple minutes. Stand by. All right, fishy folks. The fish have been acclimatizing. That's acclimating for all you non uh, rocket speakers and uh, for about I don't know half hour 40 minutes I'm gonna unbag them plop and drop stand by I cannot say enough about the packing it is definitely first class I will be buying as long as these don't die right away I will be buying from this guy again he oh it's triple bagged in big bags too. I don't ship in bags this big. The inside bag is definitely leaking, which isn't really a problem because it was triple bag, folks. All right, here we go. Flopping and dropping. You can see the hose that's right here. I'm doing some maintenance on a Hannah Leia's tank. Got pretty dirty this morning uh, with the Rapashi. So stand by, plopping and dropping. All right, fishy folks, we're gonna let those uh, fish get kind of settled in, and um, I'll show you them in a little while. All right? You're just gonna have to wait and see. What did I get? They are guppies, for sure. For sure! All right, fishy folks, here they are. Red mosaic dumbo ears. Paid a little bit more than I normally would for a, tree, for a pair, but it, it included shipping, and uh, the shipper had 100% positive feedback with over a thousand reviews so I felt pretty safe that is a good-looking guppy the female looks nice and healthy and plump he's chasing around like she's got some fresh delicious fry getting ready to cook and uh, yeah so they're gonna be in this tank hopefully in a week or two you'll see fry and I'll be happier than you know what but uh, everything looks good I'm gonna uh, feed these guys and uh, come back for some parting words all right, guys, these guys ate. Uh, everybody ate in the fish room, actually. Back to take a closer look. 
Look at how spectacular that male looks. I'm very excited to have these fish. I had Dumbo ears before uh, and I lost the colony. Um, I think at one point I just had one male left and I put him in with the mutts and that was that. And The gene is gone so I bought new. I started new. That was probably well over a year ago. But uh, that guy looks good. Hopefully his babies will look just as good. And uh, I'm looking forward to seeing the first spawn from these guys. So. Hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing video. Don't forget to check out michaelsfishroom.com. Email me if you have any questions. Everyone have a great day. All right, fishy folks. Everybody ate. These guys uh, have a little food left over. Not big a deal. Not big a deal? Yeah. <laughs>